Now, 2 News Oklahoma weather. Hi everyone, I'm meteorologist Brandon Woolley. Some big changes on the way over the next couple of days with this pattern change evolving all the way through next week on your latest 10 day forecast and already from the Storm Prediction Center highlighted here in green southeast Kansas through eastern Oklahoma. This is a marginal threat or level one out of five for maybe some strong to severe storms starting up Monday morning going all the way through the afternoon. Maybe an isolated tornado or two rolling on through the area and also that large hail and damaging gusty winds. Now outside of the strong to severe storms, it's going to be pretty windy on Monday just by itself with those gusts in excess of 40 miles per hour as a strong storm system comes in, bringing with it lots of rain. Tulsa County included up towards the north and northwest and west. That's a flood watch issued by the National Weather Service. A widespread one to three inches can be expected, though some isolated spots upwards of four inches or maybe even a little bit more than that. Live right now on our Wade's RV weather camera network awaiting the cloud cover overnight tonight. Skies becoming mostly cloudy. South winds now upwards of 10. It was pretty breezy out there today with that high temperature right at 70. 64 down towards McAllister. 54 though in Poto. 56 in Muskogee and mid 50s up towards the Grove area on the satellite picture over the past couple of hours. You can see that steady southwesterly flow pulling in that cloud cover from the desert southwest and Mexico. So again, increasing clouds tonight through tomorrow on your Sunday on future track radar in the cloud cover that Cloud cover moving up from the southwest tonight. Again, mostly cloudy skies for your Sunday. Maybe a few breaks of sun here and there, but also maybe some isolated showers starting to come in mid to late afternoon through the evening hours. And then the really wet weather comes in overnight through Monday morning. Look at all of this heavy rain. Some of this could be strong to severe, especially around the morning commute time. And then that presses off towards the east by the afternoon in throughout Missouri and Arkansas. Now again, a widespread one to three inches spots upwards of four inches or even more than that. You can see those stronger colors. They're indicative of that heavier rainfall. We're down to 56 degrees south winds tonight between about 5 and 15 with those lows down into the 50s, including Coffeyville, Kansas, down into the mid 50s at 54. Tomorrow punching up into the lower 70s south winds between about 10 and 15. Maybe a few showers very late in the day, but then that best chance for heavy rain comes in overnight through Monday morning. Daytime highs not doing too bad for this time of year on your Sunday. 70 degrees on Monday, 66 on Tuesday, starting out into the mid 40s at 46 degrees. Mild conditions at noon, mostly cloudy skies right around 70 and your extended forecast. So here comes the colder air with those high temperatures down into the 50s. Wednesday, Thursday and Friday, more breezy conditions and those overnight lows getting super close to 32 degrees in the city of Tulsa.